Hello everyone, my name is Jordan, and welcome to Arsenal Reloaded. So, you know what Arsenal Reloaded is, right? You guys know what Arsenal is, right? Do this quickly, all right? I mean, Arsenal is that really great game that I played a lot back in like 2019, 2020 on my channel. I still play it sometimes, I just haven't been playing it a lot. But, uh, the new Arsenal game, Re Arsenal Reloaded, is, uh, here. And, uh, I've been playing this game a little bit. Just taking my time on it, playing it, giving my opinions to people in chat, and so I think it's time for me to give said opinion, but video hey, form. You got if em. that's, yeah, if that makes sense. So first off, like the maps, they feel a bit, they feel a bit uh, clanky because of how blocky they are. But the maps are nice; they're really free and diverse. You can go to a lot of places on the map and like explore a lot. There's some limitations, not a lot. There's some limitations, there's not a lot of limitations. But it's it's cool. Oh, look at that. I did 107 damage and he did not die. T Classic arsenal. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So map's good. Weapons are good. Obviously, they're just they're just like reported. I think these are just like reported from uh, arsenal. Nice headshot. So you can aim down sights with some guns too, which is kind of cool. And I like sights with guns like the Chris Vector or the Laser Musket or. You know, not sights with guns, like, snipers. But, like, there are some guns that you can aim down, like, iron sights, which is kind of cool. I feel like if they implement that to... I feel like if, uh... Oh. That dude lagged. But I feel like if they implemented that to, uh, like, every other... Like, every gun has that to where you can ADS, then that would be great. Because that's one thing I found wrong with Arsenal is that, like... You can't ADS with every gun, <clears throat> and it's kind of sad, and hey, I want to ADS with a lot of guns. Uh, I see they have, I think, updated, they have, uh, I think, an updated view model for the guns. So now you have, like, layered clothing on it, layered clothing mesh. I don't know who uh, the modeler at Rolf is, but they do. But they did an excellent job for the guns, the sleeves, a lot of things, and, and the map maker also does good because well, the maps are a bit clanky, not clanky, uh, janky. They feel they feel unfinished, but then again, the game's early alpha, so it's fine. The maps feel unfinished, they feel clanky, they don't feel like you can traverse around it smoothly, you know? Um, <clears throat> also, one thing I would add, as I, uh, as I give back criticism, I'm not hating, I'm just like, mighty, really, you know, the devs. Here's some criticism for you guys. Um, you might already be on. F you might already be on your way to fix it, but this thing, like when you die, it teleports you to this void, and then brings you back to spawn. And also, sometimes audio is buggy. Um, when I was playing earlier, for recording, when I was playing earlier, <clears throat> um, the audio was a bit buggy, and I couldn't hear people. Uh, around me. Oh, well, we have a expert. It's cool. Anyways, uh, zero nine. Okay, yeah, no, uh, no vote kick system. Coolio. Um, so we have so the leaderboard is I think same or different again. 
Uh, you have everyone's ping. Wow, this dude has. Jack has 200 ping. Wow. Um. Better anti cheat. <laughs> ah. Sorry. So, uh, game's good. Right? Why'd you let that oh my god. Uh. Anyways. Uh, it's. Good map, good physics, not physics, uh, good, um, engine, you know, they're doing good. Uh, also, I love how you press numbers to vote. Uh, let's see, strike town, so I press three to vote. It's kind of cool that you use, uh, your numpad to vote, like, one, two, and three on your keyboard. Um, you guys, the devs, I hope the devs are watching this, um, because I, I like Arsenal, I'm a fan of Arsenal, bro, I've been playing Arsenal for a long time, and I'm not, I'm not here to, like, uh, shit on you guys about not knowing how to make a game, you guys made Arsenal, and that's, like, a, that's, like, a great game, unoriginal, but, <laughs> great game. Um, them all. Make them suffer. oh, what is, oh, I like this, man, this gives me, like, a... P like Phantom Forces PF kind of vibe, bro. Okay, well, besides the X words, Alberto Fob. Also, um, if you're watching this and wondering how I just have this blank, I just have these blank textures, like no uh, textures at all. Like, see here, this wall. This wall is like concrete, but you don't see concrete on my screen. You just see like smooth plastic uh, that's because I have um, removed textures on in the options you have the choice to remove textures and I do and I have the option to remove textures and I did so things that are supposed to be like you know c cement concrete wood metal um, all gone I removed the Textures to get more frames because I, I'm on a bad PC. Yeah, <laughs> but it it helps though. Um, but actually, hold on. Um, before I end this video, oh, that's a uh, weird. That can be fixed. But before I end the video, um, devs, for the texture thing, can you guys add a option for cell shade? For this, so like you see here, right? It's just like it's just a mesh. It's just like a, a mess of gray. You don't know what's what. But can you add it to where like there's uh, outlines, like cell shade, you know, where it's like outlines of the uh, things. It's so back here instead of it looking like this, this this giant mess. It could be like different lines and everything that like render out, you know. Can you try that, please? I, I would want to see that, and I think that would be cool. Cell shading for uh, no texture. Because when you have textures on, you'll, you'll be able to see what you see. You'll like be able to see what's happening and what's what. But without it, you won't. <clears throat> but yeah, that's my uh, take and everything. If you guys enjoyed the video, please subscribe. Um, and I'll make more, and I'll try to make more Arsenal videos. Okay, see ya.